a very good question, but I use that in preclinical settings. I'm coming from University Hospital Zurich, and we did the experiments in the pigs. So that means all the um, examination, all my experience is coming from this period doing the experiments in the pigs. And then uh, let's say the use of this was very useful because we cannulated, tried to cannulate it all renovisceral arteries from a different approach for the different access from the transfemoral, transjugular, transcarotid. So that means that was um, where we showed that it is possible to use this uh, flow velocity in the, in the pigs. The, the platform for me was completely new. So when we started to do experiments, we didn't know exactly what to expect. Then we saw that it's very accurate and it was very, let's say, easy to cannulate. But what we realized, we have to make some changes of the catheter. And from the first time when we started, we have several uh, adaptation of the catheter. And with the final version of catheter during these experimental settings, it was very accurate. I, let's say 95, 98%. And what was also interesting, we all this cannulation confirmed with angiography. So this is one step forward that confirmed that it was really good for cannulation. A learning curve in the peaks and in the experimental was to learn very fast because it's very intuitive, using the platform very intuitive. So let's say there is a very fast learning curve.